We are at the uh, Hornbeck Trail up in the Delaware Water Gap National Recreation Area. It is October 4th. We've got a brisk fall day. Uh, about 60 degrees, maybe the high 50s. Uh, nice breeze. Keep the gnats down. <laughs> That's a good thing. And uh, never been on this trail. Uh, from what I read, I believe it's uh, about a mile out and a mile back, so I'm thinking about two miles round trip. And uh, I've got my, uh, my lovely wife Patty with me today, but she's extremely camera shy and hiding behind the Jeep. And of course, we've got my buddy Jeter right there, who's all ready to go. It's supposed to be pretty nice. By the way, this, this trail was opened, reopened, about uh, about three weeks or so ago, and it had been closed for, I guess, in at least a couple of years as a result of uh, some storm damage. Uh, there were a lot of trees down on the trail, and uh, like I said, they finally got it back open uh, a few weeks ago. It's supposed to be a very pretty trail, so let's get started. Nope. Jeter's <laughs> gonna do his thing. <laughs> if you've seen my videos before, you know Jeter's favorite thing is to jump in the creek, lay down, and drink a whole bunch of water. Beautiful stay of old mm -hmm. big trees. Look at this one over here. Wow. Nice big tree. These are little runoff diversions that they've put across the trail. It's the second one we've come across. Yes, that prevents erosion on the trail itself. I was getting a little disappointed that I haven't been seeing much color, and I haven't. But uh, here's some, anyway. It's popping here and there. A very very dry September. Now we're October 4th. I think it's inhibiting the uh, the, the explosion of color in the in the foliage this year. We're 
in a little ravine here on the trail. Goes up on the south side of the trail and same thing on the north side of the trail. This is an east-west trail. We started on the edge by Route 209 in the park. I think it's around mile marker 11. It's a pretty cool bridge. Looks like they cut a log right in half. Very pretty. Is a huge white pine. There's a whole bunch of these old white pines here. It's very pretty. <laughs> what? Very nice. Jeter's over on the other side there somewhere. Better go find him. Come on, bub. We've done very nice on this trail. Nice set of steps going down. Yeah, a lot of storm damage. It's one thing. But the uh, Park Service, or maybe the just some type of Trail Maintenance Association, did a real nice job of clearing things up here. Come on, pal. Is he going to go across the bridge? 
Yeah, he is. <laughs> No hesitation. This is pretty cool. I'm using all trails today, and that's the trail right there. Over on the right side is 209, and on the left side is the end of the trail where it uh, exits the park. And where it looks like, based upon the blue dot, about uh, two-thirds into the trail. I'm also recording the track on Gaia, and based upon Gaia, we're about 1.1 miles in. So. It looks like we've got a little bit more to go before the end of the trail, and then we'll turn around and go back. Okay, looks like we're starting some elevation climb here, about 1.2 miles into the trail. That's the waterfall. Yep. <laughs> Is that the the road? Well, according to Gaia, we're we still got another quarter of the trail left to go. However, if you look here, unless we cross over all that uh, debris, and I don't even see a trail on the other side, we're at the end of the road, unless we want to bushwhack it. And I don't feel like bushwhacking. So we're just gonna enjoy this little falls for a little while, turn around and head back. On our way back, the sun has come out beautifully. We're going through this little tunnel of uh, maple and maple saplings. <laughs> Gee, it's going nuts. Just enjoying the the heck out of himself being a dog. Got the creek down there. He wants to go down there in the worst way. Lay in the creek. Okay, we're back at the truck, the Jeep, and uh, completed the trail. The trail uh, out to the waterfall and back, just short of three miles, and a uh, very, very nice trail. Uh, we had a perfect day. Um, just a little bit of chill in the air, a little bit of breeze. Uh, the sky was a mix of clouds and sun, but absolutely gorgeous. And uh, made a good time. Uh, nicely maintained trail now. Uh, there was a, there were a lot of trees down apparently from the storm a couple years ago when I think it was a snowstorm actually that brought the trees down. And uh, the park system, uh, I guess it's the park system and uh, a, uh, maybe some volunteers for the trails. Uh, cleaned it up really, really nice. 
the trail was filled with a variety of different trees. Lots of large white pines, very, very tall white pines. Maples, oaks, you name it, it was out there. Birches, beaches. Yeah. Had a good time. Had a good time. Uh, about an hour and a half walk. We took our time. Uh, glad you were able to come along. Hope you enjoy it. Uh, if you did, hit that like button. Uh, subscribe. And don't forget the notifications bell. So that uh, you can catch all future videos that I put out there. Adventures. So, back to the Jeep. <coughs> Say goodbye, Jeter. And uh, Patty's inside the Jeep there. <laughs> she just does not want to be on video. Anyway, thank you very much for watching. Bye-bye.